All right, guys, you see where we are. It's time to go shopping again. I'm looking at the camera. Now I'm looking at the camera. What's up, guys? BJ Kicks here. I buy comics, I read them, and I review them. All for your viewing pleasure. And we're at Ollie's, and it's time to see what we can find right after we put our mask on. Looks like, oh man. So, I'll show you something. Comic book corner is not the comic book corner anymore. Now we gotta search and figure out where they put the stuff. Kids books. Kids school books. Looks like they've moved to young adult. a lot more trades than hard cover both this time mm -hmm. let's see what we got down here show you all that Looks great, Larson. Marvel Boy. Three ninety nine on that one. So they moved the ten packs, but. The ten packs are all still mangled and run through. <laughs> they even put some in Ziploc bags. Uh, I don't trust it. Let's see what else we got on these lower levels here. Okay, we've got Squadron Supreme. I've heard good things about this team. Let's see. Batman 66. That's cool. Still got another Superman Unchained. down here. Stainless Infinity Relativity, six bucks. <clears throat> Still got more Age of Ultron trades. Got Injustice, year three. Ultimate team of work. Five nine. Paul Dameron. Three nine nine. It's Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I thought it was missing a cover, but it's just styled like that. Oh, wait, no. 
It is missing a cover. Into the apocalypse. Volume two. It's always a bunch of volume twos. Some outsiders. I do like that these trade boxes are easier to go through now. Jean Lin Yang. Superman Volume 1, but that's trying to make a thing on the cover. of uh, Jeff Jones, JFC, Marvel's companions. Some of this Marvel. <laughs> Mad Magazine. Do I really want to read Charlie Superman? Let's see. Trial of Jean Grey. Oh. No Justice League there. I fell to look in random sections too because you might find something interesting. Right, whether it's like art books or what have you. And here we go. We got Marvel's Dot to dot book. Oh wow. It's definitely something new. Your kids occupy. Encyclopedia of Drawing. Oh, let's see what else. Basic cartooning. Learn to draw cartoon characters and scenes. If they have a book on figure drawing, I'll buy that. Oh, there we go. How to draw manga. For $1.99, sure. Let's see what this one's going on. That's not for me. Attention all utilities, roll into the front, please. Thank you. Oh, look. The Art of Jock.
retail price is 60. It doesn't say what the price is. Let's look inside. Definitely sequential art in here. Ooh, love that. Yeah, I gotta get a price check on this, but I think this is coming home with me. All right, you guys, I was gonna wait till I got back home to do this, but chances are I'll forget. So you guys already saw what I bought. I didn't buy anything off of that comic shelf because Honestly, most of it was paper bags. Most of it was beat up. They really downsized the comic section. So I don't know how many times we'll be back to this Ollie's, but I'll, I'll check out some other ones in the area. But yeah, I grabbed this How to Draw Manga book because um, I like to tell myself that eventually I'll start drawing again and then I'll have reference guides to do so. Um, and, you know, the new, um, the new static artist is uh, Nick Draper Ivy. And his style seems to be very influenced by like manga and anime. So that uh, made me think this book will be cool. Now the other one, this was the real steal. This uh, Art of Jock book, huge copy. You know what, I'm not even gonna try to take it out of this bag. But you guys saw the retail price on that was 60 bucks and somebody had ripped off the price tag. So I thought it was gonna be some crazy amount. It was $10. So I walked away from Ollie's paying $12 for all of this and this jock coffee table book as soon as i get a coffee table it's going to be a great addition to it uh but anyway that's that's going to do it for me maybe i'll do an overview of one of these books later on uh but until then hope you saw something you like and if not that's cool you can always buy what you like make sure you read what you buy and be nice to others because kindness makes the world go around peace